우리가 같은 편이면 최소한 이름은 알아야 믿음이라는 게 생기지 않을까? 강세별. Welcome to Ms. Mojo. And today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 facts you didn't know about Jung Ho Young. 조금 더 빨리 그런 긴장감이나 이런 것 부담감. 그래서 자꾸 숨을 쉬는 걸 잊어버리게 되더라고요. For this list, we're getting to know the breakout star of Netflix's Squid Game a little better. Was Se Byuk your favorite Squid Game character? Tell us why in the comments. Number 10. Instagram Superstar. It's not like Jung Ho Yun was any stranger to Instagram before now. Her account has been built up over several years. Its mixture of images, professional and personal, artistic and casual, gives the impression of a cool person living an interesting life. Around 400,000 people thought so anyway, until recently that is. With the success of Squid Game, Jung's Instagram popularity has exploded. Her follower count has shot up over 14 million in just a few weeks. In the fervor, Jung Ho Yun has suddenly become the most followed Korean actress in the entire world. Luckily, she seems more than ready to welcome all those extra eyes. Number 9. Model Beginnings Acting wasn't Jung's first foray into the public eye. For several years, she's been better known to fashion devotees as one of South Korea's most coveted models. She didn't get there on just her stunning looks, though. While most models are discovered or have the help of an agency, Jung initially hustled her way onto the runway by freelancing at Seoul Fashion Week as a teenager. Since then, she's graced magazine covers and walked in high fashion shows all over the world. In fact, she auditioned for Squid Game while working New York Fashion Week. Recently, Jung also became an official brand ambassador for Louis Vuitton. It looks like we'll be seeing a lot more of her everywhere in the future. Number 8. Style for Miles just working in the fashion industry does not guarantee great personal style, but Jung Ho Young has it nevertheless. <laughs> for years, she was known for her signature bright red hair. We can't deny that the fiery color is appropriately eye catching. <laughs> Jung is also noted for her impeccable streetwear style. Though she's undeniably gorgeous in runway high style, she looks just as good dressed down. In fact, she seems to have the kind of effortless cool that can make even the simplest outfit into a head turner. Heck, she even managed to make those green tracksuits look kind of chic. Yeah. Number 7. Skincare Maven South Korea is a country renowned for its incredible skincare. Affordable, abundant, and insanely effective, it's no wonder that so many Koreans take pleasure in pampering their skin. Jung Ho Yun is no exception. In 2016, she shared her routine with Vogue. My skincare and my makeup. My skincare is custom from clinic in Korea. With that array of products, she quickly went through her multi step process of toning and moisturizing her face. She also took some time to share some valuable tips for reducing puffiness. When you feel like your face is swollen, push this point. This is good for circulation. It's always fun to get advice on new techniques or to discover new products, like Jung's favorite anti-stress oil. Who knew that was a thing? We look forward to trying some of her tricks for the ultimate game face. Let's get dressed. <laughs> now I'm ready to go! Number 6. Korea's Almost Next Top Model In 2013, Jung appeared on the fourth cycle of Korea's Next Top Model. Though now it seems obvious that she was bursting with talent, it looks like the judges thought that that was debatable at the time. Oh, 
Jung was eliminated in the third episode of the cycle, only to be brought back two episodes later. She would go all the way to the finals before placing as the runner-up. Though she might not have won the show, her top model experience raised Jung's profile and helped lead to the modeling career she would enjoy afterwards. <laughs> However, she wasn't completely done with reality shows. In 2016, she competed again on the modeling survival program Devil's Runway. <laughs> number 5. Black Pink Bestie Jung ho Hyun has a number of notable people close to her. These include her boyfriend of five years, fellow actor Lee Dong-ri, and Gong Myung of the actor group Surprise. ENFP. ENFJ. However, her friendship with Blackpink's Jenny is a standout. The two share a close relationship, with Jenny even coming to visit Ho Young on the set of Squid Game. Her support wasn't limited to a drop in either. In an interview, Hoyeon's castmate Lee Jung Jae revealed that Jenny made sure to provide sustenance too. <laughs> it's great to have the support of friends, and even better when those friends understand the importance of snacks. Number 4. Past Struggles these days, it may look like Jun Ho Young eats success for breakfast, but of course, that's not always true. She's definitely had her share of setbacks. Before her dramatic run on Korea's Next Top Model Cycle 4, Jung attempted to compete in the second cycle of the reality program and failed to make the top 15. Acting offered its own hurdles. In an interview with Models.com, she revealed an excruciating past audition experience. Quote, I read the monologue and it was so awkward that while I was reading, even I could feel that it was very bad. And I could imagine their feeling, she said. <laughs> Though she got some bruising feedback, Jung thankfully decided to stick with acting. Number 3. Lights, Camera, Then Action Squid Game may still be on top of everyone's watch list, but fans are already wondering what Jung Ho Young will do next. The actress has named Quentin Tarantino as one of her favorite directors, and especially enjoys his movie Kill Bill. We definitely know that Jung Ho Young can pull off intensity, so it's not surprising that she dreams of getting to be in a similar movie at some point. As a model, she says she appreciates the cool outfits in the movie, as well as the amazing fight scenes. Honestly, we could see her being just as big a badass as the bride one day. However, Jung is also looking to expand her range in the future. She's expressed an interest in trying her hand at romance, too. <laughs> Number 2. Creating Sebyuk There's a reason why Squid Game's Kang Sebyuk has become such a fan favorite. The North Korean defector seems tough, but underneath her stoic exterior is a girl struggling to care for her brother and reunite her family. <laughs> Jung Ho Young put a lot of effort into building her character into someone who felt real and multi-dimensional. She kept a journal as Sebyuk, finding that she could relate her own feelings of isolation from her time working abroad to Sebyuk's pain at being separated from her parents. She also watched a number of documentaries on defectors and took dialect lessons from a coach who had escaped North Korea in order to nail her accent. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. 
Number one, a squid-tacular debut. Yes, it's true. Incredible as it may seem, Squid Game is Jung Ho Young's first ever acting role. While still modeling overseas, she started making regular trips home to take acting lessons. In 2020, she was signed to Saddam Entertainment as an actor. Yeah, Though glamorous Jung Ho Young and tragic Kang Se Byuk may seem worlds apart, Jung aced her audition and was given the role shortly after meeting director Hwang Dong Yuk. <sighs> Initially, she was very nervous about her ability to actually perform the part. <laughs> It turns out that she didn't need to worry. Jung brought amazing life to Sebyeok, making her one of the best and most memorable characters in Squid Game. All signs point to an even brighter future for this breakout sensation. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Ms. Mojo. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.